Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. So we discuss simultaneous linear inequalities. So we have two equation, a uh, two linear inequalities, x plus two over and uh, more than four and four x more than twenty. So we need to find x at, for both linear inequalities. So the first linear inequalities, x is more than two. The second linear inequalities, okay, x more than five. There is no uh, reverse sign there because we don't multiply or divide negative numbers so to get the answer we need to draw a number line so uh, the smaller number at the left the bigger number at the right side so x more than 2 so our circle start above 2 okay and more than when it says more than meaning that the arrow should be to the Right, okay. Do we need to uh, blacken the circle? No, because there is no equal sign. Okay, next, x more than 4. So, put circle above, sorry, x more than 5. So, put circle above 5 and put arrow to the right because it's more than 5. So, where is the parallel uh, arrow lies? There, at the highlighted area. So, at the highlighted area, the answer is going to be x more than 5. That is how you get the answer. Okay, let's move on to C. We have 2x plus 3 more than 0 and 9x minus 2 less than or equal to 16. So, we solve 1 by 1 inequality. So, the first inequality, the answer for x is, okay, so 2x uh, 0 minus 3. Okay, so the sign is the same so we divide with positive number the sign also the same so x more than negative 3 over 2 the next uh, inequalities is 9x minus 2 less than or equal to 16 so we move negative 2 to the uh, right side plus 2 so same uh, sign no change okay we divide with positive number also the sign is the same x less than or equal to 2 so to get the answer we draw number line ok we draw number line the smallest number here is negative 3 over 2 at the left side and 2 bigger than that is at the right side so x start above negative 3 over 2 at negative 3 over 2 but x more than so you don't have to blacken the circle and put the arrow to the right ok because it is more than then we start x at 2. Now should we blacken the circle? Yes, because it can be 2. Okay, then we can blacken uh, the circle because x can be 2 or less than 2. Arrow is to the left because it can be less than or equal to 2. Okay, next where is the possibility of x lies? So where do we can see the arrow uh, bertindih antara satu sama lain? So it's tengah tengah. So, we need to write down both linear inequality. So, the first linear inequality, x more than negative 3 over 2. And the second inequality is x less than or equal to 2. That's the answer. Okay, let's see the last question. 5x minus 7 less than 13 and 7x plus 4 less than 16. So, as usual, 13 plus 7, no... Uh, change no reverse sign okay sign is the same and divide positive number also sign is the same so x less than 4 okay next 16 minus 4 so sign the same also the same uh, 7x over 7 12 over 7 divide positive number so signs is the same so x less than 12 over 7 to get the answer, we draw number line. Smallest number here is at the smaller number, 12 over 7 at the left and bigger number 4 at the right. So, first x less than 4. So, put circle over 4 to indicate the x uh, start from there. But it can't cannot be 4. Okay, but it is less than 4. So, the arrow to the left and the circle is not blackened. It cannot be 4. Okay. And then x less than 12 over 7. So uh, the circle is above 12 over 7 to the 
left so we don't have to blacken the circle because there is no equal sign and the arrow is to the left okay next where is the parallel arrow okay at the highlighted arrow there, there. so the x has this fight at x less than 12 over 7 thank you see you again